So one of the most important Islamic institutions in Trinidad and Tobago is the Islamic Home for Children, located at Rahman Drive in Gasparillo. This year, 2024, the home celebrated its 35th anniversary. It was launched in 1989 through the help and the assistance, of course, of Almighty Allah, and Maulana Shafayat Muhammad, who is now an imam in Florida, United States of America, was one of the leading figures, along with the late Hafiz Majid and our brother Hamzad Muhammad. They were all there when the Islamic Home for Children started off in 1989. Over the weekend, the home had a dinner to celebrate its 35th anniversary, and our good friend, Brother Hamzad Mohammed, has filed this wonderful report to give us details of the dinner organized by the Islamic Home for Children on Saturday, the 13th of April, at the home in Gasparillo. So now we go over to Brother Hamzad, who has sent along some beautiful pictures from the night of the event. Assalamu alaikum to all. It was indeed a pleasure for our esteemed institution, the Islamic Home for Children Incorporated, to hold an Eid dinner and anniversary function on the 13th of April, 2024, on the home's compound. The dinner was well patronized by the public. Sister Donna Ali, the organization's president, gave a short, inspiring speech. Sister Donna is a very hard-working board member who devotes a lot of time to build the home. Also giving a special address on that day was the general manager of the Children's Authority of Trinidad and Tobago, Sister Bandana Susanka Ali. Her talk was edifying. The home's children sang an Islamic song and recited a poem. The audience were well appreciative of their performances. A sumptuous meal was provided by a caterer. A few people were still observing the fast, and the home ensured that their needs were accommodated. Such is the kind courtesy of the home. And yes, all other attendees were well treated. Special awards were handed out at the home. One recipient was yours truly, Brother Hamzad Mohammed. Brother Hamzad was the first volunteer in 1985 of the National Muslim Sports League, the forerunner that led to the formation of the Islamic Home for Children Incorporated in 1989. Another awardee was Brother Imran Khan, a former president of the Who. On dinner day, he gave a brief, interesting historical account of the institution. Deserving of special mention on the day is Mr. Ryan Mohammed, PRO of the Who. He was the master of ceremonies. His execution in that capacity was top class. One cannot forget the input of the General Secretary of the Who, Sister Aziza Mohammed. She gave the appreciation of vote of thanks, which was very well delivered. It was heartwarming to see and listen to Hafiz Umaru Thompson, former resident or child of the womb, give the Quranic recitation. Finally, deserving of special mention are the hard-working board members of the Islamic home. Hats off to them. The workers of the home made solid inputs. Great. All were ably assisted by the children of the home. Super. All praises to Allah for a successful dinner. Allahu Akbar. Amin. Okay. We well, thank you very much, Brother Hamzad Mohammed, for that very comprehensive report on the dinner organized by the Islamic Home for Children for Eid and, of course, to celebrate the 35th anniversary of the founding of the Islamic Home for Children. Now, you know the story about the Prophet, peace be upon him, and how much honor he gives to the person who helps the orphan. So if you can contribute to the Islamic Home for Children, we urge you to do so. It's a very simple process, and we want you to get a pen and a piece of paper so you can take note of these numbers, how you can contribute towards the development and the progress of the Islamic Home for Children. 
It is a great cause to serve, and you can make a donation. It's a very simple process. You can set up your standing order today with your bank. For as little as $50 a month, you can make a difference in the life of an orphan child. All you have to do is to take the bank account number of the Islamic Home for Children. It's there on the screen. It's a Republic bank account number, 830-1811-26901. Take a note of that. The number again, Republic Bank number 830-1811-26901. And you can donate and contribute a monthly donation to the Islamic Home for Children to make sure they have food and clothing for the children and so on. And all of the necessities for life are accommodated for at the Islamic Home for Children. If you want to contact the home, the, there's a, a telephone number and an email address and so on. The telephone number at the Islamic Home for Children is 650-0773. That number is 650-0773 or 491-3315, 491-3315. And the email is islamichome786 at gmail.com. The address is Rahman's Drive, Bonaventure Road in Gasparillo. You can also find him on facebook.com slash Islamic Home for Children. It really is a beautiful cause. And you know the saying of the Prophet, if you can take care of an orphan, you and the Prophet will be finger and ring, very close together on the Day of Judgment, inshallah. So we hope all of us can come together to support the Islamic Home for Children. It has been in existence for over 35 years. Now, the children, yes, they need food, they need clothes, but more than anything else, the children of the Islamic Home for children, they need company. Because remember, these are orphans. They have no mother or no father, and they're living in this residence. So they need the company of fellow human beings. You may know one of the children of the home. We urge all imams and all jamaat, so call the home. Call 650-0773 and make an appointment to spend a day at the home. Carry members of your jamaat, cook food, make the arrangements with the home, and make sure they know you are coming and carry your family and friends and members of the Jamaat and spend some time with the Islamic Home for Children in Gaspar. You'll get great rewards from Almighty Allah. It's a great blessing to take care of the orphans. You don't have to tell anybody anything, just do it. Help those who cannot help themselves. And we hope and pray Almighty Allah. Remember that Republic Bank account number, 830-1811-26901. I hope I'm reading it correctly. 830-1811-26901. A Republic Bank account in the name of the Islamic Home for Children. You can set up a standing order. You can make a general contribution. Whatever you want to do, you can give zakat if you want to the home. Your zakat money can be paid towards the Islamic Home for Children because those children are poor and they need help and they need all the help they get. They need the love of you, the people of Trinidad and Tobago. Make them feel that they belong. Make them feel that they are worthwhile. That's what they need. Something to boost their esteem and to let them know that they are worthwhile citizens and they're going to be good Muslims here in Trinidad and Tobago. So we're looking forward to your support for the Islamic Home for Children, and we salute all members of the Board of Directors, Sister Donna Ali, and all those who contribute towards the Islamic Home for Children. Brother Hamzad Mohammed, our good friend from San Fernando, former teacher at the San Fernando Astra Primary School, has been a leading light at the home. He's no longer on the Board of Directors, but he was there from the very beginning when this home was started by Maulana Shafayat Mohammed, and the late Brother Hafiz Majid, may Almighty Allah accept his sacrifices and grant him Jannah. And all those who have contributed towards the Islamic Home for Children, may Almighty Allah accept your sacrifices and may this home grow from strength to strength. And may the children who reside in that home be happy, good citizens, good Muslim citizens of Trinidad and Tobago, inshallah. Hats off and happy anniversary, 35th anniversary to the Islamic Home for Children. We here at IBN have always been strong supporters of the home, and we will continue to be strong supporters of the Islamic Home for Children in Gasparillo. Whatever you can give, help them all, please.